गुड मॉर्निंग ऑल आई एम संदीप देसाई फ्रॉम डी वाई पी सी ओई अकुर्डी टूडे इज माई टॉपिक इज ग्रीन मैन्युफैक्चरिंग इम्प्लीमेंटेशन केस स्टडीज दिस इज माई वीक वन वीडियो ग्रीन मैन्युफैक्चरिंग इन दैट वी विल डिस्कस करंट इन्वायरमेंटल प्रॉब्लम्स ड्यू टू इंडस्ट्रियल डेवलपमेंट नीड ऑफ ग्रीन मैन्युफैक्चरिंग गोल ऑफ ग्रीन मैन्युफैक्चरिंग advantages of green manufacturing and implementation method <coughs> in week two video week two video green manufacturing implementation in that we will discuss the method and need of the implementation of green manufacturing iso 14000 and uh, iso 14000 series overview eco labels used in india this is outcome of the video to understand impact of industrial development on environment to know effect of green manufacturing implementation on various aspects of industries to get knowledge about the iso norms followed during sustainable development standards under iso 14000 series these are some important standards comes under this series it is iso 14001 is used in ems standard iso 14010 is used for auditing 14020 about environmental labeling iso 14030 about environmental performance evaluation iso 14040 about lac thing about environmental life cycle assessment now what is carbon footprint a carbon footprint has historically been defined as the total set of greenhouse gas emission caused by an organization event product or a person the carbon footprint is the sum of all emission of co2 which were included by your activities in a given time frame so this is a table which shows the carbon emission by consumption of petrol that the 1 liter petrol emit 2.3 kg of carbon similarly gasoline diesel and oil 1 liter consumption emitted 2.3 kg 2.7 kg and 3 kg co2 into environment using this example we will discuss how to calculate the carbon footprint consider a car consume 7.5 liter of diesel per 100 km then we drive a car for 300 km so total fuel consumption is 3 into 7.5 which is equal to 22.5 liter of diesel now we know that for consumption of 1 liter of diesel produce 2.7 kg of carbon so the total carbon produced during this journey is 22.5 into 2.7 which is equal to 60.75 kg co2 to your personal carbon footprint these are all some daily activities which add 
वन के जी ऑफ सी ओ टू इन युअर पर्सनल कार्बन फुटप्रिंट नंबर वन ट्रैवल बाय पब्लिक ट्रांसपोर्ट ट्रेन और बस अ डिस्टेंस ऑफ टेन टू ट्वेल्व किलोमीटर एट वन के जी ऑफ सी ओ टू इन टू इन्वायरमेंट ड्राइव विथ युअर कार अ डिस्टेंस ऑफ सिक्स किलोमीटर विच एड वन के जी ऑफ सी ओ टू इन टू युअर पर्सनल कार्बन फुटप्रिंट सिमिलरली फ्लाय विथ द प्लेन अ डिस्टन्स ऑफ टू पॉइंट टू किलोमीटर ऑपरेट युअर कंप्यूटर फॉर थर्टी टू आवर्स प्रोडक्शन ऑफ फाइव प्लास्टिक बैग्स प्रोडक्शन ऑफ टू प्लास्टिक बॉटल प्रोडक्शन ऑफ वन थर्ड ऑफ अमेरिकन चीज बर्गर दिस एवरी एक्टिविटी एड वन के जी ऑफ सी ओ टू इन टू युअर पर्सनल कार्बन फुटप्रिंट सो दिस इज वन केस स्टडी इन विच विल डिस्कस द इफेक्ट ऑफ ग्रीन मैन्युफैक्चरिंग ऑन कार्बन फुटप्रिंट नंबर वन लोरल प्लांट इन पुणे इनिशियली इन द प्लांट दे यूज इलेक्ट्रिक वॉटर हीटर टू हीट द वॉटर but after study they use solar heating to preheat the wash water and the outcome is they save 93 tons of co2 per year or 6% of total energy use they achieve this by using 320 solar panels which spread over 920 meter square area the second case is the orchard product it is a american company which manufacture milk and milk related product and which supply to the walmart they calculate the carbon footprint in 2007 so this is carbon footprint bond rates of that company as a scope to is the electricity scope 1 and scope 3 in that suppliers supply the milk to the manufacturing site so the transportation is required then the warehouse in the required refrigerant primary distribution of piece and buildings and then supply the product to the customer for this required customer transport also is the waste disposal and recycling business travel so from that they found these are the sources of green house gas emission that is electricity refrigerant stationary source of fossil fuel consumption that is natural gas diesel propane kerosene fossil fuel consumption in transportation then the implement green house green manufacturing strategy went to their company and take some initiative in that first they train their worker as that is employ awareness turn off equipment when not in use weekend shutdown use maximum solar energy they do some modification in transportation for example biofuel use and hybrid delivery vehicles truck skirts and rerouting they they upgrade the lightning of the plant they replace the old equipment for example replace variable speed air compressor install a new ammonia refrigeration system upgrade 
solar hot water system also operator reduces the sanitizer use keep the floor dry turn off the floor chains and conveyors during downtime so up to one year they get this output that is reduce the plant energy by 6% which save 58740 dollars in one year and the table shows the output of implementation of green manufacturing that is the plant energy reduced by 6% greenhouse gases emission reduced by 9.9% use of water reduced by 9.2% and uh, transportation reduced by 9.9% so this is one case study this is one survey which shows impact of the green manufacturing implementation on various aspects of industry which improve brand image by 34.9% improve cost saving by 10% competitive advantage by 9.5% employee satisfaction moral by 9.2% effective risk risk management by 5.3% and many more so this is the impact of the implementation of green manufacturing on industry this is one initiative taken by IRCTC to save the paper that is save 3 lakh a4 size paper by digitalization is another example in which eight recycled plastic bottle used to made one football shirt now also it is required to make the student aware about a green manufacturing and environmental awareness of the student is required so how green is your college so this is a questionnaire does the college have a policy to use recycled paper does your college seek to avoid the use of disposal of paper plastic foam cups and plates etc so these are 20 questions which you have to answer to find out how green is your college and how to assess this 20 questions So the score is yes two marks partially one and no zero so the report card is if it is 35 to 40 then you are doing excellent if the 35 30 to 35 quite well 20 to 30 not yet a green college 0 to 20 must do better next turn so from this we will decide our college campus is how it is green this is new considered as a greenhouse club which spread awareness among the student and people about the same and help to maintain the plant green as whole well. also form on club in college which calculate carbon footprint of various day to day day activities of individuals or an organization and find and suggest the major to reduce the footprint of individual or an organization as a whole these are some benefits of a such a club into your college gain knowledge about the environment student are very much aware about the carbon footprint perform action to improve the campus environment and maintain it green 
help to solve local environmental problem educate others about environment enjoy yourself and have fun and this club will promote environmental literacy as well as raise the quality of your total educational experience thank you